everyone. It is Friday, April 16th, 2010. Uh, let's see. Um, yes, you know, I, uh, you all know I go jogging, and let's see. I'm kind of sore from particularly yesterday's jog. Man, I have to talk over the music. Thanks, Ramstein. Uh, what is it? I'm a little sore from yesterday's jog because um, <laughs> I don't want to point any fingers. But what is it? Um, yesterday, uh, Pauline came with us, and you know, uh, let me explain why, you know. Things are a little more from a workout when Pauline comes with us. Okay, so normally I go with my sister and my mom, and sometimes uh, Pauline's mom, uh, she joins us. But when Pauline comes with us, you know, she's young, she's full of energy, and she runs very fast. So we had to keep up with her yesterday, because she's always like at least a quarter mile ahead of us. So I'm always like, is that Pauline in the distance? I don't know, I can't see her. But yeah, so you know, that, that was an extra workout, so I'm kind of sore and I had trouble sleeping. Thanks, Pauline. Yeah, no, I'm just kidding. If you ever watch this, I'm sorry. I'm just kidding. But yeah, um, let's see. I took my art history exam. You know, remember it was canceled on Monday, so I had uh, to take it on Wednesday. And you know, uh, we got lucky. So what happened was my teacher, she lost her passport, and um, she could not make it uh, to school on Monday. So she wasn't even in the country on Monday. She said she got back um, the following day on Tuesday, and then she came to our class Wednesday to give us her test. But yeah, um, the extra time really, really helped. I think I did well, and I really hope I did. But you know, we'll see come uh, Monday. If she has them graded by Monday, you know, some teachers, they, they take longer to grade them. But yeah, so you know, I think I did well in that. And I'm also proud to say uh, I took a math quiz yesterday, and I think I did well in that too. If it, and uh, possibly, I don't want to sound cocky, but I might have even gotten 100% on it. I actually guessed on one question, but hopefully I guessed right. But yeah, I deserve a big tap in the back end, something nice um, if I get 100% and if I do well on my um, art history exam. Yeah, yeah, speaking of exams and tests and, you know, things of that nature, uh, I have my biology exam on Monday, which I need to totally study for because it's 200 questions, um, 100 question uh, practicum, which is a lab, and then two, um, another 100 questions for the objective, which is the uh, Scantron, you know, yeah, the multiple choice. But yeah, so... It's a little difficult because, um, you know, when I'm trying to, you know, think about, recall uh, biology information, I all I can remember is art history because I just I studied so much for that one. So I'm like, oh, you know, blah blah blah, you know, chaparrales, you know, they're like this and that, and the arms and the infant Dionysus. What? <laughs> so yeah, I'm, I just God, art history is to get out of my head for now. But yeah, I mean, you know, that section's over and done with. Uh, as for more redundant topics, um, I'm. Finally going to go to the Getty Villa tomorrow, and after I go and write my report, you will never hear me talk about it again. Unless I go for something recreational. So yeah, um, you know, so you know, I'll be done with that soon enough. Uh, let's see, um, 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 what else? Uh, you know, my video blogs are always about school, and I'm sure that, that really bores you guys. So, um, let me see, what, what things did I talk about, um, what is it, in my previous ones that weren't related to school? Uh, Nothing about my puppy. Uh, da, da. Um, oh, that cherry print skirt. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> yeah, I finished it. Um, oh, I need a, a hook closure. Yeah, I don't quite like it too much. I might redo the pleats, but you know, simple skirt. Yeah, wearable now. But just need to put the hooks, or you know, just be a cheater, use a safety pin, got the zipper and everything. Let's see. Oh. Um, I also, I don't know if some of you have noticed, but I do have other videos aside from my video blogs uh, on my channel. And uh, they're actually not very si exciting, <laughs> and I know they aren't. And I don't know how many people watch them, but you know, thanks to those of you who do. But um, I don't know why I was compelled to, you know, capture myself, um, what is it, actually coloring this in. I actually have them start to finish, so they're only one take, and uh, I don't ever redo them because, you know, once you apply the color, that's it. But yeah, so um, I'm, I guess you could say I'm halfway along, sort of. Uh, my only dilemma right now is um, trying to figure out the color for the, um, the clouds and the sky. But um, the fish, they'll be orange. But I don't know if that's like too many warm colors or what. And um, I was actually going to make her outfit like some sort of red and pink. But like I said, I don't know if that's too many warm colors. But you know, we'll see, we'll see. Yeah. Oh, man. Um, in other news, what is it? I don't know why I was, you know, re-hit with the urge to get some kilt rocking horse shoes. Uh, you know, the guy ones, uh, not the girl ones with the lace-up uh, straps. I already have some of those. They're not real, real wood, but, you know, I do already have a pair, and I don't really need another as much as I would like wood. 
But yeah, um, sad to say, uh, I went to go on uh, Double Decker's website and they've discontinued the shoes I wanted. And um, the only ones left in my size is one pair in white and, every, and black is completely out and they have pink in a couple of larger sizes, but that would never work. But yeah, so you know, that was a bit of a, uh, what is it, a nostalgic trip. Because what is it? Uh, I went to look for other websites where they might have uh, rocking horse shoes, and you know, I came by all these other pretty Lolita shoes, and I was like, oh, these are so cute, and you know, that would look great with that. So, yeah, you know, a little nostalgic, and um, I don't think I'll be returning to the Lolita scene anytime soon, but if I do, um, I think I'm going more on a Kadona level, wearing, you know, pants and coats and things like that. Something that's more practical, because you know, I'm just an easy hobo like that. Yeah.